Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello everyone. Well, I'd like to be able to say I've never seen rain here at Wembley before, but that is most definitely not the case. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's England versus Germany. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Kyle Walker plays alongside Luke Shaw as fullbacks. Phil Foden plays with Raheem Sterling out wide. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. Is it going to end up being productive for them? But they dealt with the threat post. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer stands between the posts. Kai Havertz starts with Leroy Zane in the wide areas. And the focal point in attack today, Timo Werner. Opportunity here. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. How about the short corner? And Sterling has it. Now Walker. It's a cross towards the near post. Well, it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Rudiger. Well, it's a team full of stars, and you never quite know who's going to pop up and shine. Perhaps, Stuart, it'll be Raheem Sterling today. Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Kane. Shaw. Mount. Sterling and pull back and he did well to cut it out oh big chance really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing The short corner routine. An authoritative challenge. Thomas Müller. It's with Gundogan. Now can they create something? Defended well. Superb effort to keep it in. On and on he goes. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Kane. And they could face difficulties here. Kira. It's with Gundogan. Top class defending. Kane. Here's Mount. Henderson. 
Henderson. Can he convert? Great reflex action from Neuer. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Well, they're going for the short one. In by Sterling. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Foden. He's got to score! And a goal here from Harry Kane! He's opened the scoring. What a boost for his team. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. And once again, Germany get the ball rolling. How will they react to this setback? Tilo Kehrer. Müller. It's with Gundogan. Sané. And a throw-in it's going to be. Sané. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Henderson. Harry Kane. Phil Foden now. And you can sense the threat is there. Foden. Walker. Not a touch off the defender, last of all. So a corner. <laughs> Taken short. Sterling crossing. Well, thumped clear. Henderson. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. And there it is, the half-time whistle. What a rip. And the ball is moving again, with England looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance. Kira, that potential danger. Sané, determined defending. Well, the hopes rise as they win a corner. And short it is. Well read to put an end to that attack. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, terrific defending to stop them progressing. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Sterling. Foden. They won't complain about having won the corner and maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. Oh, 
Well, they fancy a short one. In by Sterling. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Müller. Timo Werner. Zane has it. Alert defending. Mount. And England pushing forward with options available. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. And they will make the change now. Gundogan. Leroy Zane. This is looking threatening. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. And space to cross it. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. Now the delivery, oh, mopping up defensively. Mount. Sterling takes it forward. Real chance. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Müller. Tilo Kera into the final 20 minutes showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up he has time to play it over well he's lost it Henderson Now Harry Kane. Excellent passing. Now will the cross work out for them? Leroy Zane. This is Müller. Gundogan. It's with Gundogan. And the attack continues with Müller dragging it forward. Mount. Here's Luke Shaw. Ten minutes to go then. Well, just listen to the noise in here. These fans are doing everything to get their team over the finish line. And there's not long left now. And now, passing it through. Able to deal with the threat. He's in here. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Now, they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. He's driven in the corner. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And not testing the keeper at all with that effort. Mount. Declan Rice. And Rashford. Shaw. Might 
still be able to do a bit of damage. Well, they can keep possession now. Kira. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And the flag does go up. Must have been close. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Henderson, Saka, dangerous looking attack, excellent ball towards the front post, and there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well Derek, it was very competitive, chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserved their victory. And the shining light for his team, no two ways about that, Harry Kane. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.